Hello there. Welcome to Contlo. In this video let us understand how to set up your first automation using Contlo. Automations lets you target users with specific behavioral patterns and other user events using triggers and let you create a series of automated workflows across channels like email, SMS, webpage, etc. You can create automations in Contlo by simply clicking on the Automations tab over here and then navigating to the Create Automation area. In Contlo, automations can be created in two ways. You can either choose to build your first automation using these pre-built templates that are already in here. Or you can choose to build one from scratch. First let's try setting up an automation using a pre-built template. For our first automation let's build an abandoned cart flow. You can do so just by clicking on the abandoned cart email. Here you can see a pre-build flow, which of course you can modify to best suit your requirements. For example, let's change wait time for the email to 15 minutes. You can also schedule these emails to be sent on a specific day of the week and on a specific time of the day. You can also modify the content of the email by simply clicking on the email block and clicking edit email. That will take you to our drag and drop email editor. Once the changes are done, just save and continue to return back to the automation builder. Similarly you can also add a few more follow-ups to the same flow across all channels. You can find all the automation blocks on the left sidebar that can be added simply by dragging and dropping the desired block into the flow. In this case let's send another email after 3 days. Once you are happy with your setup, just click on launch automation and that's how you can choose an existing automation template and modify it. Now let's see how to create a similar abandoned cart flow from scratch. For now, let's call this automation abandoned cart on the channel. Unlike the template flow, here you'll begin with defining your trigger. In this case choose checkout started from the list of triggers in the drop down. Also set up a cancel trigger that will basically pause the automation once a certain action is done by the user, in this case it will be placed order. Now let's send an email and a SMS to all the user who never completed the purchase after adding a product to the cart. With a delay of 1 hour before email and 2 days before sending the SMS. We already saw how to edit the content of an email, let's see how to add SMS content. Click on the SMS message block and add the copy in the message text field. Additionally, you can also let the user unsubscribe from the SMS sequence by checking the reply stop to unsubscribe. Or add some discount for a product in the message text. Contlo also lets you personalize your SMS by adding user variables like the first and last name of your customer. To do this, hover over the tags icon and select the required variables to customize your SMS messaging. Once done, send a test SMS to yourself by clicking on send message. This concludes our video on how to create automations using Contlo. In our upcoming video, we will talk about creating advanced and much more complex automation flows using split condition, which will basically create a split journey based on the user's behavior and action triggers. You can also set up an internal notification or use webhooks to send out custom triggers to a third-party tool. See you next time.